The best color to paint interior doors. When you think about painting a door in your home, you'd probably agree that the most attention to detail is given to the front door. While it's certainly a plus to put careful consideration into your home's exterior, what you see on the inside is just as important. Interior doors specifically are an overlooked part of a home. Stick to a theme. When choosing a color for a door, it's recommended to seek inspiration from the home's existing palette. It depends on the aesthetic of the house in terms of choosing a finish for the home, says Eric Weathers, a luxury real estate broker and interior designer based in Beverly Hills. He suggests taking the metal finish of the door handle into consideration as an example. No black door knob for a black door because it would make it hard to see, especially in the dark, he explains. According to Barry Livingstone, an interior designer, realtor, and author based in Malibu, California, it's best to keep the color scheme of a smaller home or apartment monochromatic so as to open it up. I would keep the door the same color as the walls because if you start changing colors it could make the space look smaller, he says. It's a color block that draws attention to it in a small space. You want it as monochromatic as possible. Choose something widely appealing. If your home is, or will ever be, on the market, it is important to choose a color with more universal appeal. Something that is current but not too specific allows you to appeal to the highest number of buyers, says Weathers. Interior colors in trend at the moment include white, gray tones black, and even taupe, which is gray or beige with undertones of the other in it, according to Weathers. Try a pop of color for a statement. In the event that you don't have to worry about creating the illusion of more space, a pop of color is more than welcome for inside and outside the house. If you're doing a bright color on the front door, it should translate to the interior as well, says Livingstone. Sometimes people paint the front door red or blue but the inside is white. He cites markets like Palm Springs, California, where people choose colors like orange, yellow, and turquoise, which translates to a fabulous pop of color inside the house. A solidly decorated door can also serve more than just aesthetic purposes, according to the realtor. Doors are very important statements because they are symbols of power, he says, listing Feng Shui as an example, under which red doors symbolize prosperity and wealth. Make sure to have the right finish. The biggest mistake many make when it comes to doors is not the color, but the finish of the paint, according to Livingstone. Interior doors get a lot of wear and tear, so it needs to be wipeable, he says. The finish needs to be satin or semi-gloss to ensure you can wipe the doors clean. He also suggests having the doors painted by way of a paint roller or spray so as not to see the brush strokes. Choosing the right color for your interior doors. Interior design is so much more than the color you choose for your walls, the type of furniture, or the lighting. There are some fixtures, like doors, that are necessary but it doesn't mean that they don't play a part in the overall decor. In fact, even if your entire room looks great, an old or unattractive door can completely throw everything off. When choosing interior doors for your home, remember that you can choose a different door for each room. Choose the color the door based on the color scheme, theme, and style of each room. The size of the room will also play a part in your decision. 
For example, a smaller room is usually decorated with lighter colors in order to make it appear more spacious. For an understated yet classy look, a lighter shade is the best option. A light brown, white, or light shade of gray will be the perfect fit depending on your existing furniture and core. On the other hand, if you want something that creates contrast, then a darker shade of charcoal or dark brown might be even better. Another important factor to consider is whether you would like something simple or a door with one or more glass panes. This choice is not just about style, but also lighting. If the room needs additional light and the door is in the right position to allow for extra light, then you should consider a design with at least one glass panel. As for style and theme, if you have a modern design, you will want a modern door with striking features. For example, a dark charcoal door with one or more panels of glass and just the right hardware like the door handle will be the perfect fit for a modern room. Close your eyes and imagine light-colored walls with black or gray furniture and perhaps glossy ceramic or even chrome decorative accessories throughout the living room. Now add the perfect door and watch it all come together. The same can be said for a country-style living room or bedroom and a rich brown-colored door. When you choose the type of flooring, your bed, and any other furniture, make sure that you keep your interior door in mind as well. While you may prefer to keep your walls in neutral color, you can certainly add some floral designs and colors in the way of a decorative bedspread, drapes, and a delightful rug. If you were to use a dark or gray door for this room, it would stand out rather than complement the room. Finally, don't forget about maintenance. Every door requires cleaning and maintenance in order to keep it in top condition. If you want a door that will stand the test of time, quality is your number one priority. Cheap interior doors might be acceptable for a short period of time, but it won't take long before they show signs of wear and tear. Doors with glass panels often require a bit of extra cleaning, but the benefits far outweigh the amount of time spent on maintenance. It's also good to note that darker colors tend to reveal fingerprints more easily so. If you have children or pets, a gray or medium to light shade of door might be your best bet. Whenever in doubt, take a photograph of your room to the showroom and ask a professional for their expert opinion.